What is up, my crazy beautiful Divine Kenny? My name's Redico, you can call me V, and welcome back to Pokemon Let's Go uh, Pikachu or Pokemon Let's Go be a Pokemon Master. Today's episode is episode 4, and in today's lovely jubbly episode, we are gonna go. Well, we're gonna hunt Cubone Candy, because, well, I can. <laughs> that, and we're looking to get an Alolan uh, Marowak shiny hunt going for episode 5, potentially episode 6, and potentially episode 7. We'll see how it goes. Do a lot of soft resetting for that, so I've got a keep this uh, chain going while I can, get as many of the candies as I can. I've got two players that I'm using as well, um, he says, but can't find the second player. There they are. Perfect. Uh, so we've got two um, people that we can play with, hopefully a bit more candy. I don't know if that actually works, but from past experience, I think it does. Anyway, um, the one thing I want to talk about, if you guys aren't following my Twitter and Instagram right now, you should probably go check it out at the moment. I have posted an image of what my next tattoo will be. It's a pretty easy, <laughs> pretty easy clue, so I'm super hyped for you guys to see it and uh, well, find out what it's going to be. Hoping to get it within a couple of months, and obviously you'll be able to see it on Instagram and Twitter. I may even do a video about it with the first one I've done. Uh, but yeah, it's looking very, very interesting. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm so excited for this series. I, I appreciate it's a new series that I've just started, but I love Pokemon. I'm so glad you guys are joining me for this. So I'm looking forward to the next generation as well. I'm looking to do streams of this game soon and streams of Hungry Dragon. Once the uh, housework's completely sorted, we're going to jump straight into that. I'm so excited because streaming and getting videos sorted in, like weeks in advance, I'm doing really well. I'm so happy about that. So let's go ahead and, well, let's jump into it. Let's go for this a huge cure burn and try and remember how the hell I am. Um... Right, I do remember how to do it. It's fine. But I don't quite have the aim perfect to go into the center for cube burn, but it doesn't matter. Um, as long as I get the um, connection bonus and the, you know, first... Oh, I've not taken the freaking Marowaks out of my party. So that means they're going to get XP, which is going to be a big dampener because they'll have to level up and take time. Oh, they didn't They didn't level up. That's fine. A little bit hurt with that. But, you know, I didn't even also pay attention to how many Cubone candy we got from that. That's fine. Let's go ahead and sort our party back out. So let's stick in everything that's a level 100, shall we? <laughs> um, sort search. Level high to low. Perfect. Uh, add to party, yes, please. Uh, add to party, yes, please. I don't think I've done the um, Rapidash Master Trainer yet, but that's fine. Um, we will get on that at some point. Uh, probably as soon as we've done this hunt, we're going to do some Master Hunt, uh, Master Trainer sort of battles. We'll take it from there. Um, okay, and then Pikachu, you're already in my party. Blastoz. Basically, get rid of all of these Marowaks, and I'm done. Happy as Larry. Perfect. Okay. Also, my um, Sancho is like all EV trained as well for hyper training. So happy about that. Don't know what I'm doing. This place is also where I'm going to be hunting for um, Shiny Charmander when we get to the Shiny Charmander hunt, which isn't just quite yet. Oh, that would have been an excellent throw. Like, so it's a little bit of a shorter throw. I've got it now. I think I'm getting the swing of things. Uh, so the videos are going to stay around 20 minutes for this video. Next video might be a bit longer. The reason being is because after like 9 to 10 minutes, the audio desyncs just by a second. Then it does it again at like 18 minutes, so um, I have to keep moving the audio around. So you may notice around the 8 to 10 minute mark that the audio goes, blah, blah, blah. then it gets sorted again, and then again at probably the 18 to 20 mark. And potentially, if we ever do a longer video, even longer. I'm really hoping that doesn't affect streams, but we'll soon see. That was only one. No, it wasn't one throw. Apparently, that wasn't, but okay. I thought there was only one ball that hit him, but it's fine. Got enough Q-Bones now, and Trey did enough Q-Bones to be able to catch it with a Pokeball. Uh, so I transferred like, I think it's 50 Cubone before it got better. I think it was like 50 Cubone caught. I could be wrong, uh, but obviously in case you're not aware, catching a certain amount of Pokemon really does help towards um, how easy they've come to catch. So you can just use Ultra Balls to begin with uh, or Great Balls, depending, you know, cost effective and if that's going to work. Or you can, of course, you're going to... Oh, nailed it. Um, but of course, you can just sort of whatever's easiest for you. I, I like using Ultra Balls because... I don't have to use as many as I would in a Great Ball, so I guess it's cost effective, but for your Cubone, you could probably get away with using a Great Ball, so uh, personal preference, I suppose. I've not been paying attention to the Cubone candy I've been getting. I keep pressing A, just second nature. Uh, so we'll actually start paying attention now, don't worry. We're going to go straight for this huge one and try and get him on throw number one this time, so. Yeah, he almost got me. I uh, only got a Great, but I'll, uh, I'll take it. Jumped the gun a bit too early there, but it's it's it's, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> um, also realised how small the webcam <laughs> is in regards to the actual video. That will be fixed in the future. I am going to work and try and get some graphics, of course. Oh, six Cubone candies. Yeah, I wasn't getting that many before, but 
Uh, that's fine by me. I definitely think that two player giving you more candy. I'm more than happy to be proven wrong, but I just feel like it does. At least it has for me. Um, all right, so we're going to go ahead. Oh, you're not a jumper. No, you're a Q-bone, but you know what I mean. Uh, oh, an excellent throw again. I'm acting like it's an achievement, whereas like 95% of the population attain that, so. <laughs> no worries. Uh, Q-bone, please give me, come on, six Q-bone candy again. Seven. Uh, fine by me. I know this XP could be going towards some Q-bones that I've already got in the party. And to be fair, I will put them in shortly. Um, I just want to get as many of the candies without like having to press A and smash through our, uh, Marowak evolutions. But the more Marowaks I can get, the better. I've got quite a lot off camera. And obviously I've been using some of the newer ones I've caught to be leveled up. And of course, it is working. Um, and getting them with the XP from this has also been what I've been doing. Oh, it's only a great. I should have given it an extra second, but well. Um, but it is sort of really good to sort of get a candy build up. Because I need to get enough candy to um, max out my... Um, shiny normal cubone and then enough to max out my shiny alolan marowak when i get it so it's gonna be fun i am looking to do all the alolans obviously with pokemon let's go pikachu i haven't got eevee as much as i'd love to because then i could get the um volpix i can also get a shiny arbok which is something i want but i can't so hell any cubones any cubones yup right there okay i've also seen another shiny gold bat i think i've already got one i think i caught the other one i saw but um basically I'm not too fussed about any of the shinies in this area, bar a shiny Charmander, or a shiny Kangaskhan, or a shiny Rhyhorn. I've got everything else. Um, so Zubat, potentially Zubat, because I haven't got Zubat, and that's one of the ones I do need to <laughs> at some point, and I hate having to catch them because they're a pain in the butt. But not overly fussed at this moment in time. Um, but yeah, I've been, I have been—I shiny hunted Rhyhorn in the past, didn't have any luck with that, but hey ho. Shiny Rhyhorn pops up, you better believe I'm breaking the chain. Shiny Charmander pops up, I'm breaking the chain again. But we'll, we'll tackle that bridge if we come to it. There we go. I'm just more focused on getting this lovely candy for now. <sighs> come on. Because otherwise I have to build up such a big chain again to start just bringing in as much candy as I can. Pretty sure I could probably be going out and selling the other candy at this moment in time. But trust me guys, I'm not too fussed about that. Wow, 6,120 from just catching a Cubone XP. Wow. Issue being is if I stick the other Cubones in, they've got to level up, they get their Bomerang or whatever the hell, Bone I don't know what it is, the first attack, and then when it evolves, it gets um, Sword Dance, so it's one of the most annoying to evolve. <laughs> just because of the levels of just before it evolves, it's a pain, and the level of, and when it evolves, it's also a pain. You're about to jump. I stopped you with an excellent... Thank you. This... Oh, come on. Just a shiny. You don't shiny in this video, you know what I mean? I appreciate we've not had that much... Um, this is what episode 4 meant on the shiny hunt, but I'm trying to keep shiny hunts to, um, not a minimum such, but sort of nice and spaced out. Uh, I don't want the whole series to be just shiny hunting, I want to sort of see the journey that I'm having to take to get to the shiny hunting, because you see a lot of shiny hunting and you're like, oh, I, I can go jump right into that, and you can, a lot of the time, especially in this game, but you do have to prep for things like a shiny Alolan Marowak, like, you have to get, like, so many Marowaks just to build up a nice soft reset part. I just hit myself with a <laughs> Ow! <laughs> so I do this at short distance, like this. So it's easy, but when you do it with such force at short distance, ow! That really... <sighs> Damn it. Uh, let's see what we are dealing with. I'm going to check up on that candy now. So I had 215, I think, before we started, so let's have a nice little... Oh, just ran into a cube. You know what? I'm fine, we'll check it after this. <laughs> you just spawned, didn't you? Oh, that would have been an excellent throw. I'm starting to get really stuck at the hang of this, so it's like that. Or like that, and then of course, like that for normal. So, you know, I'm like a, practically a ninja at this point, and you know, with all my katana slicing. <laughs> I'm sure that's exactly how that works. Um, yeah, we didn't get any candy for that, that's understandable. I didn't get any catch bonus, so apart from first throw and you know, synchronized, that's understandable. So, let's get my bag, the candy, the scroll. Oh, we've got quite a bit so far, so I'm gonna warrant, um, we still need 142 more candy. <laughs> But, 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 open Pokemon box, and, um, Q-Bone, add to party, Q-Bone, add to party, Q-Bone, and so on and so forth, you know the rest of this cycle, so, there we go, add to party, and Q-Bone, add to party, and the last one, Q-Bone, add to party, lovely, right, the more Marowaks I get, as I said, the better. Um, I have no idea how much I've actually got. I think it's at least above 80. Um, might even be like 85 or something. No, plus ones I've got. Potentially, I'm nearly at 100 now, if not already there. But, once again, 
Sand shrews I had much more, but that's because you didn't have to evolve it, so it took a lot less time. <laughs> this one's going to take a little bit more time, and considering the fact that the um, Shiny Gods or Ketsuban has already graced me with um, an Alolan Sand Shrew, as well as a Bulbasaur after so, so long, I'm not going to count my blessings. Uh, I know I am going to count my blessings and just, you know, we're going to ride it out. As I said, it could take a couple of episodes before we get that beautiful Alolan Marowak. So we will see how that goes, to be fair. Um, yeah. Oh, no, I turned down my um, gain on my microphone by one more than it should have been, which may mean that this may be slightly quiet or echoey. And I apologize in advance. So, I oh, well, no, there's more. Like, oh, you can walk into it. <laughs> That's cute. Um... There we go. Something I didn't even realise before, so... Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, mamma mia. Right, that was awful. Don't catch it on... <sighs> really? I'm not going to get any candy. I'll probably just get, like, exactly no candy. 416 XP. Ooh, big spender. <sighs> Damn it. Right. There's a Charmander. There's the cure bone we've been waiting for. And then we're gonna. Obviously, I want to be able to capture Charmander whilst chaining Charmander, uh, just because more candy, um, easier to catch, and, and stuff like that, as well as getting a chance to get it at more than four IVs, which would be nice, you know. <laughs> well, I keep calling them EVs, AVs, producer, but yeah, IVs and AVs. Um, there we go, Cubone Candy. Uh, seven, and lovely, and a lovely bit of leveling. Time to hammer the A button. I, I've given up on scrolling down for this point. I just keep pressing A, so it gives me stuff to do. I just can look away from the screen while I do it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so um, obviously this series is going to be quite long. It may even take us all the way up to, if not after, when the new Pokemon is released. When the new one's announced, obviously we're going to be talking about that. And I am so excited because we've potentially got a Nintendo Direct on the 13th. Um, we're expecting Animal Crossing, and you bet your butt I'm playing Animal Crossing when it comes out. I love Animal Crossing, the fact that I can actually play it and record it without having a 3DS capture card makes me so happy. Um, but we are going to have to obviously um, look at that anyway, but in the meantime, obviously, my recording setup is going to change a little bit more. We are expecting to get a few more things, uh, like a boom stand for my um, Yeti uh, mic, which hasn't made an appearance since Minecraft. <laughs> Walking with dinosaurs, um, so that's interesting. Um, we've got just more stuff to record in the future. Uh, I am going to want to branch out a bit more. Don't worry, I'm going to keep it all stuff that I enjoy. Um, I, that's my main intention. Um, but there will be games that I want to try. And I, I won't know if I'll enjoy them until I try them at the end of the day. Um, obviously, we've got some long-standing series that I promised you are going to continue. Jurassic Evolution um, is going to continue until we get to 100%. Have you, you timed out? Um, obviously we've got Jurassic World, the game that's going to keep him continuing until the game closes down, or my channel does. <laughs> um, and uh, Jurassic World Live, we may make a reappearance in the future, it's just because I've not really had much time to play it re until recently. That um, I've sort of not gone away from it, but I'm still playing it massively, it's just I want to put it on my channel. Well, I don't know, I was about to say I'm not doing that great, but I am. So yeah, we'll, we'll make an appearance with that soon again. Do not worry. We've also got loads of... Um, other things coming, like I'm recording a couple of episodes of this, an episode or two of Hungry Dragon today. It, they'll take time because Elgato takes its time to render it. Um, and then if we've got enough time later on, a bit more Jurassic World Evolution. So I've got a backlog which I can edit throughout the week and record a bit more throughout the week too. So we're, um, we're going to have a productive week. So yeah, uh, these Cubones are one level up of leveling. I used to think it was level 29. I think I may have even alluded to that in the last episode, but it's level... Hey! <laughs> Ow, level 28. Oh, that hurt. Oh, bless me. <laughs> I like those couple of key bones to go catch. Right. And you do your thing. Yeah, you're going to hit me. That's adorable and stuff. But now you're going to get caught. You're potentially, you've sent to a professor with a farm filled to the brim with like over 1,200 Bulbasaurs. Or you're going to become a Marowak that's going to be sent through a computer to be traded for a different version of you, which is a terrifying and black mirror based thought, but hey ho, here we go. And you guys thought you escaped all of this in the last episode, didn't you? Oh, we don't have to watch about that Marowak training all over again. Well, sorry to say, you really haven't. <laughs> oh dear. Um, 
But yeah, no, the Q, like, this candy farming guide is, like I said guide, but this candy farming uh, is sort of not just generic to Cubone, it's, it's, it's available to, as I'm sure most of you be aware, all Pokemon. Your best bet is get a big, big chain going, and you can do that normally in handheld mode, um, and then you can either put this onto a screen, or like I didn't for a long time, if you don't have a screen to put it onto, simply put it on the kickstand, put it somewhere safe, strap these two in, obviously enabling the two players, and just go catching loads more, and you'll get more candy um, if you're using two players. Now, I'm just saying that subjectively, I don't know if that's the case. However, before this video started, I was doing it with only one player, and I was getting four or five candy apiece, uh, which is why I was like, oh, come give me six, give me six, not I put it in, and they gave me seven. <laughs> so, I'm going to say it probably does do something. Can't be certain. I'd love to know what a golden pin at barrier using two of these guys would do, because that'd be great. I'm looking for 400 Cubone candy, so we've got quite some time to go. Obviously, it will take a little bit longer evolving these guys um, and doing it at the same time, but well, that's fine. I also need to just pummel tough candy into the already shiny Marowak I've got, so yay. It also means I can have a shiny Marowak and a shiny Cubone and a shiny, a shiny Alolan Marowak at the same time, uh, which is what I wanted to do with the whole Pokedex, but having seen how long it took me to get one Bulbasaur, I sure as hell am not going to do that if I need to do it for another two Bulbasaurs. Hell no. Just no. Because that's an additional 70 hours. Three days in game to do that. No spank you very much. No. No. Just no. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to pummel A a bit longer. So, yeah. Like, if you're just doing this to just farm, I know that you could obviously just go no, 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 and make it a little bit quicker. But if you just don't want to pay attention, you want to keep recording or streaming or. Just doing other things in the meantime, like I do this when I'm editing, I just keep like doing this, getting them to level up. Once they're leveling up, I'm just pressing A and then editing a bit more. Stuff like that. It's 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 great for multitasking, it's all I can really, really say. And then Marowak, you have graced us with your presence once more. I am terrified to think of how many of you I have now got, so hey ho. Because I'm a... Oh my god, Cubones. Like, think of it this way. All of, all of these Cubones' mothers like died in a tragic way, which is no longer a coincidence. It's a tragic genetic disposition. Which means every single one of these Pokemon that I have currently got these Marowaks are going to have a child and cause this disposition. <laughs> wow. That's depressing. Good lord. Right, okay, I think this is the last one, or second to last one. And then we can get back to Cubone Candy Farming. There we go, that was. Um, I could obviously get some more Cubones going on, and that's exactly what I'm going to do, so... Here's my box. Yeah, yeah, I know, add to party. Boop. Then remove these guys all at once, because it makes it a little bit easier, just pressing A, A, A. Yup. And A, yup. Just grabbing you, you, and you. There we go. I would love to know how many cubones, <laughs> how many um, Marowaks I've got. I could probably count them, but it's just so much time to take. Now you get back here, jumps away and comes straight back. Like, come on, candy jar. 276, only 124 more to go. Um, although I probably won't do all of that for this video because like, I can do a little bit off camera. It's the only thing is I have to rebuild the chain again. Um, if I sort of say, no, we're gonna call it like 300 or something because I have to go soft reset in the next video for the Alola Marowak. So no, let's not. Let's not just go, oh, we'll, we'll do a little bit off camera and then stop. No, I'm gonna have to do as much as I can in this video and do a lot more off camera. Um, but I think, on that throw... Oh, really? That was more than warranting of that, thank you. Spank you very much, so... I wish the trade of the Lolo Marowak was like, yeah, just give me a load of Cubone, it'd been so much easier. So much easier, right. Oh, perfect, excellent, right. Excellent synchronicity bonus, gonna be a good amount of XP. Just give me candy. Just give me the damn candy. Just always realised how lightly low I am on the camera, and my hairline is just looking so shiny. I want a shiny Alola Marowak as shiny as my forehead right now, but that's just not possible. Yeah, yeah, I know you agree to level twenty-five. Oh, you know what? Oh, level twenty-six. You um, move apparently. Didn't remember that. But that's fine. I'm not gonna complain. 
Uh, I think the next Cubone that we're going to get, we're going to just try a Pinup Berry, and I think we'll probably leave the video there, so. Come on. There we go. Oh, I'd, I'd prefer a huge one, because we could really... Oh, damn it, right, there is one there, so not the last one, that's fine. we we'll just use you normally, though. That was only a great throw, so we'll tough that one out, though. Um, so we're going to try a Pinup Berry, try to get an excellent first throw. Probably not going to happen, so... Oh well, but we'll give it a crack. So, nab nab berry and not even close to what I wanted. Oh, this video is going to be longer than I wanted it to be. I forgot about this part. <laughs> I completely forgot about this part. <laughs> Why does it do this to me? Why? I want to do it though. I want to get it done in this video. Appreciate sure that may mean I have to do like this audio editing thing three times over for one video. Considering the fact that Elgato takes like double the amount of time that you took to record it, to render it. If not a little bit more, this video might be done by 5 o'clock. <laughs> I've got videos up so far, going up every day Wednesday, and that's like Wednesday the, I don't know, 13th, 14th, I can't remember. Um, so, I've got videos going up every day till then, and I need to record some of these, because I have loads of stuff on Backlog for Jurassic World Evolution, my Parkosaurus last episodes are going up, because I can't do much more till the bugs are fixed, um, and going to record some Hungry Dragon too. So I'm going to have a big, big backlog that I need to edit through and go through whilst recording more. And it just keeps me on top of things. And it also gives me breathing space if an update comes out of Jurassic World Game or Hungry Dragon or Jurassic World Alive that I really want to record. So, you know, it gives me a lot of breathing room and I can work with that. So, hey-ho. Please tell me that was the last one. Yes! Right, let's go for this damn Cubone. Right, give me the Cubone, not the... Thank you. Right. Yeah, he's not going to do the thing where he jumps away. He's just going to swing at me. Yes, we got exactly what I wanted to be. A pinup berry, excellent throw, first throw, synchronized throw. Let us see what my reward is. So, uh, right, let's actually pay attention to the reward before we get the damn leveling. He says, only six. I got a seven earlier without using one, so that's annoying. Oh, well. I think this is a great place to leave the video. So if you have enjoyed today's video, please smash the like button. If you haven't already, sure subscribe and my crazy buddy comments, I'd super duper appreciate it. If you are subscribed, make sure to turn on notifications so you know where more of my videos are going up. Of course, there is a Pokemon Let's Go Be a Pokemon Master, or whatever I've called the playlist, uh, available for you to peruse. I think I've made one by now. I'm hoping I've made one by now. Um, and go ahead and check it out because you can watch it from episode one up to episode four, which is this current episode. I can remember this, I think. <laughs> So that's great. Oh, anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching today and joining me. Have a nice day and ta -ra!